Hello everyone, thank you for joining me. I'm doing a set on my left hand. I always do both of my hands different, so I'll do a different set on my left and a different on my right. And for many reasons I do this. I get sick of my nails real quick, and I don't know if it's because I do nails. When you know when you do them, you just you know you can go fix them yourself real easily. So I get really sick of the same old thing. So I usually have on my left one different, on my right one different, and actually it's a great way to promote yourself. So if you're just starting out, you don't, you're trying to get your clientele, always have your nails done because this is what's going to happen. You're going to be in a grocery store or a, you know any type of the mall anywhere, and if someone likes your your ha your nails, they're going to say, "Where did you get those done?" Well, I did them. And you just got yourself a client right there. So that's another reason why I always have my nails done differently so that I can promote myself. You know, I have different designs on this hand, different designs on that. And you see here, I am just blending in the tip like I always do. And then um, I'm wiping off the dust. And then I'll get my cherry alcohol. And then I'll spray that. And then I'll remove all the excess dust with um, my alcohol and my brush and then I'll scrub it with my scrub brush. So for this set we're going to use Gelish um, from Harmony pH Bond and Young Nails Protein Bond and we do two coats of the Protein Bond on each nail. All right, so for all five nails, I'm going to put a very thin coat of clear acrylic because we're going to be using white, which is a, a strong pigment. If you put that straight onto your nail, it will stain your nail like white when you go to take it off. So all five nails, I'm going to do a thin coat of clear acrylic. white that I'm getting ready to put on three of the finger actually two of the fingers sorry I made this mix myself it's uh, you see me here mixing it it's white with just a pinch of gold glitter like a shimmer I wanted but I didn't want to put pigment because that would change the color so I just put a little pinch of some gold glitter so I have gold running through it and um, actually I have another mix just like this and I have a little pieces of gold mylar flakes with the glitter running through it. It's beautiful. Um, but when you do this, you want to mix some clear acrylic. So if you do five parts white, you want to do five parts clear. So um, the reason why I put the clear is because the white will totally um, take over the little glitters I put in. So the clear makes it to where it, it pops more. You can see it running through. And here I am just applying um, my mix to two of the nails. All right, so on my pinky, I use this other beautiful mix. It's a nail bed color, I think. Um, I'm sure it's a nail bed color it is. It's from Crystal Nails, and it's the most beautiful color. It's got gold shimmer running through it. So I try to show you a close-up in the end of the end results, but you see gold shimmer, and I love this color. And then for the ring finger and my thumb, which I already had my thumb done, because I'll always have one finger done, client, if I'm going to videotape it um, or record, because I have Instagram mini videos too. So I'll do one finger for Instagram, so I'm not dissing on them, because I've been... I've, ever since I did these YouTube videos, 
I've been dissing on Instagram. So I I try to make sure I try to upload to them still too to Instagram. But um, I do one finger always. I'll have one finger done, and you'll notice it's because I did that finger on Instagram. So anyways, this color I'm putting here. It's so pretty. Um, I love this. It's the Organic Nail Collection um, Wonderland. And it's the white one. It's my favorite one. So it's got flowers and everything running through it. So for my thumb and my ring finger, that's the color we used here. And then I cap this with clear acrylic. You don't have to cap any of the other nails. The other one's a nail bed color. The pinky's a nail bed color. You don't need to cap that. And the other two are white, so you don't have to cap those. But I do cap the the thumb and the ring finger for these um, with this glitter mix. I do cap these ones. So All right, guys, and let's not forget to pinch all five nails. And when I'm pinching these nails, I'm not doing it very hard at all. And someone asked me if I can show them how to do the use my carbide around the cuticle, and this is exactly what I'm showing how I do it here. So um, I don't have it at a mock speed, real high. I just have it medium, and I go around the cuticle area and then around the nail, just a. a around the whole body of the nail and you see how I'm doing it um, you got to make sure you have you have control of your drill when you're doing this and I have to admit I cut myself all the time with my files and stuff because I'm just so fast on myself and I really don't care if I cut myself but um, if you're doing a client you gotta watch exactly what you're doing so here I'm hand filing to put the nails into shape like always So here I'm just adding my gel top coat on two of the nails, the ring finger and the pinky. And then for the middle finger, I'm showing you I'm using Bill Gel because I'm going to use it as my glue for this little baby ring I'm going to put on the middle finger. And then I'm going to put some Swarovski crystals on the pointer finger. And I'll just put some gel top coat. I'm just going to use my gel top coat as my glue for that right now. Um, you see I'm putting the ring on right here and then I just go into the lamp and after it's done curing and then I just get rid of the inhibition layer with my alcohol and then I'll just go around it with my gel top coat as well just like you see me doing here and then um, when I do the pointer finger and I do the Swarovski crystals I just use the gel top coat as my glue like I said and um, these are really pretty crystals I love the colorful ones um, I get my Swarovskis from Tammy's Place. If anyone needs to know where to get some, I get them from Tammy's Place. They have every kind and pretty much every shape that you need. And here's the end result. I'm showing you what they all look like. And I want to thank you guys so... Don't forget to add your cuticle oil um, in the end. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time. One last thing, you guys. I was wondering if you can help me out and give me some feedback on what you think about the music. Should I have music or no, no music or really, really low music? Um, some people aren't liking the music. Um, some people are saying they can't hear me and un, um, focus on what I'm saying. So um, I really would like your guys' feedback. This, I made this channel for you, not for me. So um, please, if you can just comment and let me know what you think, I'm going to start, um, I will be basing this channel off what you say. So if more people say music, I'll have music. More people say none, I'll have none. So it's really all up to you guys. Thank you guys.